gonna be too heavy, right? Nope, Semper Fi. We're coming up. We made it. <laughs> Takes more than a few bats to kill you. Oh man, that was unfucking believable. Those things were all over us. Me and Celine busted through them like it was the last down of the goddamn Super Bowl. <laughs> Mm -mm. Listen up. I'm not out of the woods yet. What I see in front of me, you're the best. Fuck that. Best of the best. And we will get home. Hoorah. 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 Come on, you can do it. Hoorah. Yay! <laughs> he did it. <laughs> good, Hoorah. good lad. <laughs> Not so nervous, like you have to you have to you have to believe. Oh, it's her. Fuck. Jabba, get the Jabba. Get the Jabba, get the Jabba, get the Jabba, get the Jabba. If you kick like a bitch. Don't look over there, she's gonna pop up. Girl just didn't know how to stay dead. Oh god, you're close to the edge. Get away from that. Like you wanna die. Night. It's good. Well.
You stay with me, buddy. <laughs> we got two alive. Very fucking ready to go home, Marines here. This is Bailman 2 1 Actual to Coyote 2. Radio check, over. Hey. Hey, you might want to get out of here, but they ain't gonna like you. They might, they might be alright with it, I don't know. Improvise, adapt, and overcome! We fucking did it! Look, look around you. It's so quiet. Hello, sunshine. Am I happy to see you? I must return home to my boy. He must be worried about me. Uh -uh. Oh no. Not again. Celebrate too soon, Jack. What's the sun back? You tell me, I don't know shit about space. Contact! No. No, 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 Yeah. It's been interesting knowing you. Oh god. I'm sorry, but I pressed the wrong button. That was clean. Oh, fuck. It's not expecting square. My egg, sorry.
god, how long is this gonna go? <laughs> Send help! Oh god! No wrong button press. Holy shit. They're still alive. I need to see my boy. A souvenir. Shalane, wait. Good luck, brother. Ah. Wish Shane a happy birthday from me. Thank you, Jason. Goodbye, my friend. wanders off into the desert, you know. I don't think Jason's alright though. Do you handle that vampire but that's he ain't he ain't gonna be alright, is he? Just ignore the demons laying on the floor. The vampires is dead everywhere.
Oh god. They, they're alive. Freely they stood who stood and fell who fell. Not bad. You've Thank guided you. some of your charges to the light, while others have fallen to the dark. Survival often comes at a great cost. A cost that others sometimes must pay. I look forward to our next encounter. Perhaps I'll choose a story that's a little more homely next homely. time. Yes. Somewhere you'd be guaranteed of a decent night's sleep. Rest assured, wherever it is, you'll find it extremely hard to leave. I look forward to Until it. Until the next time. You know the way out. This isn't the end. No, it's the end. Are we getting some kind of like cutscene? Yeah. You're late and you look like shit. I just got off the red eye. What's your excuse? Good flight? Oh, shit movie, shit meal, no leg room. You cram me in the back? By the toilets. Nice. Coffee wasn't so bad, though. Good fucking muffins. Did you read the brief? On the flight. How's it going with the analysis team? The ISG team took heavy losses, but it wasn't a complete disaster. We just had to scrape some of them off the floor. Poor bastards. And the entities? Like nothing we've seen before. Uh-oh. Oh, there's the parasite. Cool check, Jason. First Lieutenant, Marine Force Recon. The best of the best, huh? Or so they advertised. Fuck! Now how many times do I have to keep telling you the same damn story? I understand. However, SETCOM needs to iron out any irregularities. Such as? The whole fucking thing was irregular. Such as why you allied with an enemy combatant? You weren't fucking there! Those things were ripping us to shreds. I don't give a damn who it was. We needed all the help we could get. You tell him. I stepped back into that hell to save Celine. And that man was worth five of you people. Semper fucking five. You tell him. And he Colonel jabbed Kane? like 20 monsters. What about Colonel fucking Kane? How did he die? He led us all the way to hell. Hell burned him up. Lieutenant Kolchak? That's a nasty cough. His biopsy results just came back in. The future's not looking so rosy for a war hero. Mm -hmm. How long has he got? Hopefully enough time for the experiments. Experiments? So cooperated with an Iraqi soldier down there? Republican Guard, if you can believe it. Must have made a hell of an impression for Kolchak to go back for him. I'm dying to meet this guy. Nothing to show. He walked. The hell's that mean? By the time the extraction team got here, he was gone. Oh, so he could have been here. The border by now. Sneaky son of a bitch. Now I see why Kolchak enlisted his help. The analysis Good. team is still pulling specimens from the site. It's carnage down there. They use dynamite? We don't know how they got their hands on it. No, 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 no. I'm done. I told you already. It was a city, a goddamn city full of those things. There were cocoons down there. Fucking thousands of them. How many organisms were still alive down there? Too many. Oh, for all his sake. They're all fucking burdened. This is like Winterfold all over again. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Uh, and here we have Colonel Eric King, our in-house genius. What? He definitely got more than he bargained for. Oh, he's dead. Those two okay. were married, right? In the loosest sense of the word. Jesus. Blue on blue, apparently. Kicked one of his own trip wires. Whilst running for his life, no doubt. This comes down to Caleb. It mistook the temple for Saddam's weapon depot. Piece of shit system. I wouldn't say that. It's been a big find for us. We've been lucky. This is your definition of lucky? Uh-oh. Dear God. There's barely anything left to identify. You read her profile. 
Yeah. She could have gone far. If this hadn't happened. We still on for next Sunday? Janet's making hot pie. You bet your ass we're on. I'll never get used to this job. Why would you want to? At least this one was localized. A small blessing. So, what do you make of it all? Doesn't matter what I think. Only thing that matters is controlling the flow of information. As far as the world knows, not a damn thing happened here. Interesting. Interesting. I'm gonna skip to the end because this might be like monetized music or some shit. I'll risk it. You want to know what it means to be a killer? Think of the most profound thing you've ever done. The most beautiful thing you've ever created. And I promise you, it's nothing compared to watching the life bleed out of someone. To see the fear in their eyes. To feel them pawing at you for release. To hear them pleading, begging. That's true art. That's what you have to be, an artist. I've left my mark on the world. Have you? And that's what we'll be playing next time. <laughs> well, not next time, but we will be playing The Devil in Me at some point. That was the train report. Nice. More people that we can actually murder. I didn't mean to murder anyone. Honestly, it just mistakes happened. A lot of them. But I enjoyed that. Um, there is always hope, <laughs> as I'm saying about... New milestone reach. Trophy level up. It says we unlocked a new special feature. So I don't know what that means. We missed three of these, but I guess I might have been on different paths or something. We missed not that many secrets. I'm genuinely surprised. Not that many, but you know, enough. And those are the pictures, right? Got you. It says special feature unlock, so I'm just trying to figure out what that actually is. Bonus features. Oh, are these are the interviews. Watch an interview with Ashley Tinsdale. Short documentary on making the creatures of the House of Ashes, and you unlock them by finding all the channels. Interesting, so we missed some of the journals apparently. But they might have been down different paths and stuff like that, you know, different routes that we could have taken because there's a lot of like decision choices that were made. Interesting. I thought it was a good game. Um I am gonna say I am a little bit disappointed. Um because obviously it's my own fault. I saw a statue of Pazuzu and thought this game was going to be about Pazuzu. It was not. There was nothing. There was like one statement regarding him that the creatures resemble him. And then that was pretty much it. Which is kind of a bit sad. I would have liked some, you know, cool shit about Pazuzu would have been cool. But that's my own fault for looking at the Pazuzu statue and assuming, hey, this game's going to be about Pazuzu. It was not. Still a really good game. Really cool story. Um, 
we could have done a lot of things differently. For some reason, I started this game off and I was like, hey, I'm just going to choose this guy's going to be an asshole to everybody but his ex-wife just to be annoying. And his ex-wife's going to be a bitch for no reason. I don't know why my brain did that, but it's the first time I've ever done that playing one of these games. So I'm going to just try and play it like, and try and keep everybody alive. But I just wanted to make it a bit different um, this time. So that is it. That is just to play through. Um... I might replay for a bit again and try and unlock more and see if there's much difference. There seems like a lot of possibility in this game, like, um, compared to, like, uh, what was the last one we played, the Frank Stone game? There was nothing wrong with the Frank Stone game. I, can't, I really did enjoy it, but kind of, like, seemed like everything led to a certain ending. Um, I feel like this game has a lot of different branches to it. 